Time now for news from the French West Indies. Dominican writer Rita Indiana has copped the Great Literary Award at the 5th Congress of Writers of the Caribbean held in Guadeloupe last week. We get the details from our partners at France Caribe Broadcast. Rita Indiana. It is Rita Indiana, the rocker Dominican writer who won the region Guadeloupe's Great Literary Award at the 5th Congress of Writers of the Caribbean. Rewarded for her book *The Mu Kama Dio Mink and Lay, released in 2015, Rita Indiana represents the new generation of authors of the Dominican Republic as explained by Delia Blanco, Franco-Dominican writer. She represents a new generation of writers. She's Dominican. The Dominican Republic went through her a literary prize, but it's a new generation of the Caribbean who wins this prize. Because Rita Indiana, who is she? She's a writer who responds to the new values of literature and a new semantics. The semantics that mixes writing with music and at the same time the message between ecology and rebellion. Moreover, she has an insular discourse, that is to say she thinks that the dialogue between the Dominican youth and the Haitian youth is possible, and all this at the rhythm of the urban music in writing, that is Rita Indiana. I'm happy for the emerging writers of the Caribbean. They had in this contest a beautiful play through her. An original choice on the part of the jury of this fifth Congress of Writers of the Caribbean, which was held from April 6th to 9 at the Memorial ACTE in Guadeloupe, a Congress entirely supported by the Regional Council. As the territorial collectivity of Guadeloupe, the region has decided to favor the repressment with the neighboring countries of the Caribbean. And culture is an important vector for this repressment. This is the reason why the Congress of the Writers of the Caribbean was imposed upon us, because we felt that this Congress should make it possible to get closer. We thank our partners over at France Caribe Broadcast for this week's submission and we encourage you to join us every Monday for news from the French West Indies.